very quickly, the Blue Alliance with a cargo pod inserted into the lower hub. But the Red Alliance has put two in the upper hub. Now the Blue Alliance has put one in the upper hub. It is 18-10 to score as we exit autonomous mode. Let's see. As all day long, the Commodores have been a force to be reckoned with as they put two more for the Red Alliance in the upper hub. And now we see Metal Mountain playing a little defense as the Commodores put two more pods in the upper hub. And the Robo Lions with two additional cargo pods in the upper hub. We've got a 36-10 score with the Red Alliance in the lead. And it's raining red cargo pods for the Red Alliance as once again the Commodores put two more pods in the upper hub. We've got the Mill Creek Steel Talons collecting some pods to insert. But once again, the Commodores with more cargo pods in the upper hub. The Metal Mountain from the Blue Alliance are trying to play a little bit of defense as they're giving a little bit of a, a love tap to the Commodores. The Commodore is trying to set and take out a couple of shots that they do. We're under 30 seconds remaining as teams head to the hangars. We'll see what's going to happen as it's 57-15 Red Alliance as the Commodores are on the middle rung as well as the Robo Lions. But whoa, Nelly! The Benedictine Military Bot Brothers have made it to the traversal rung. And for the Blue Alliance, the Middle Mountain have made it to the middle rung. We'll open up the court, tally the scores, and announce your winner forthwith. And flying high somewhere over the Gulf of Mexico in our 787, the Red Alliance is your winner. The Red Alliance will advance to the semifinals. 